hello so today i actually got in an order from stacy from sugar melts by stacy i honestly wasn't paying attention clearly because i saw the package and i was like oh what came today and then i looked and it's from stacy so i've ordered from stacy multiple times you can see my videos that I've um, of things that I've hauled before I actually ordered I went in there twice because she added strawberry clouds was it raspberry cupcakes I forgot a hundred percent but she did combine them and um, I said if you have any issues just let me know if that's not okay so she did package this she did change her labels I think in this order yes she did and I think she added scent notes. So I was really excited about that. So I have a sample. Um, it's raspberry Twinkie, which is raspberry jam yellow cake. I'm excited about the, the scent descriptions. This really does smell like raspberry with yellow cake. I am not a big yellow cake person. I don't know why. I just don't love that in general. But I love that she sent me samples. Ooh, this one is raspberry Twinkie. It's raspberry... What? Oh, are they both the same? Yeah, they are, which is fine because I'll warm them. That's a good amount of wax to warm in an area. So she had this on top and then they're bagged up here. And then I'm assuming the loaf is right here. All right, so let's get into this. So she does have new labels. Okay, so hers is a... Um, is it a so I can't remember her blend, but it's unique to her and there's no cure time. So this one is lime cake. So it's lime, lemon zest, meringue, vanilla icing and yellow cake. And then she has February 2022 and she's in Virginia. Oh, this is good. You're going to hear my dogs. The kids are. Oh, my gosh. This is a nice lime. Oh, love it. I love a tart lime. A look at the color and I love bright neon colors mmm this is really good gosh if you hear my stomach growling I'm sorry it was a long day at work and I literally ate my lunch at like 2 30 oh this is really good mmm yummy yummy lime oh that's so good I love that tartness of that okay this one is raspberry cupcakes well I already had this one <laughs> We'll smell it and see if she she was posting some sneak peeks on. She started a TikTok and then she was sharing it. And oh, look at the colors. I love that. Again, I can definitely smell that yellow cake. And I I mean, I'll warm it. I'm happy to have it. But again, let's just see how it performs on warm. Because like I said, it's my own fault if I don't. Like I've, re soon, I've recently realized I'm not the biggest yellow cake lover. But I love the raspberry in this. Okay, this one is Berry Fizz. Blackberry, strawberry, and pomegranate. I love pomegranate. Oh, look at this cute little straw stick in here. Oh, I can smell the pomegranate and I, I'm here for it. Oh, because it's like this a little bit of tartness from the pomegranate. I definitely smell the blackberry and the strawberry, but boy, that pomegranate makes me happy. Oh, that's so good. Yummy, yummy, yummy. I really like that one. Really like that one. Again, these are all, I think these are all new to me except maybe one. So it's really hard. For, oh no. So peach ice cream, you know I love this. This is the best peach ever, ever. So I could have gotten this in a loaf, but I already have two loaves. And I was like, oh, I really don't need more, but I should order it. Because then I'm always like, oh, what if I don't have it? So I got a souffle, even though I don't really need it. But it's fresh peaches and vanilla ice cream. What I will say is this literally smells like you are taking peach cobbler that you made out of the oven. And that is exactly what I get. I think this is the best peach wax blend I have. If you if you haven't, if you've tried this, do you agree or not? Or do you have one that you love better? Let me know down below because maybe I have it. Maybe I haven't tried it. I don't know. But I really enjoy that blend. That is like one of my favorites from her. 
This one is cookie jar. This is frosted animal cookie, sugar cookie royal, sugar cookie dough, vanilla ice cream, and buttercream. Now, I'm really nervous. I should have gotten a loaf in this because I feel like this is more my jam. Oh, it has a little... I'm wondering... This was on here, but I'm wondering if this is like... I'm assuming these are candy, right? Oh, this is good. Buttercream can be hit or miss for me because I get like a sour note sometimes. I don't get that. It's very, very creamy buttercream. I get the animal cookies, like the crunchiness of a cookie. And I do get like sweetness like of a sugar cookie as well. So I get like a crunchy cookie. with buttercream on it, which is good. I love the color she did too. I still have to say that Berry Fizz with the pomegranate is my favorite so far. This one is Twinkle Little Star. Pink sugar, sweet lavender, peppermint, and cream filling. I'm happy that she did, is doing the scent notes. Oh, this, ooh, this is a great lavender blend. Oh, I would like this. Oh, look at the colors. Mmm. This is a very well done pink sugar lavender. Very good. The lavender to me is sweet, which I like. I don't like medicinal lavender. The peppermint is there. Oh, this is so good. Very, very good. This I got this for bedtime, obviously, and you know, so I'm very happy to have this. This is gonna go right into my um, bedtime blend because my bin is getting kind of low. I know that might be shocking to some of you, but my bedtime blends sometimes do get a little low. Okay, this one I was excited for because I saw some sneak peeks. I believe in magic. It's sweet sugary crystals with hints of sweet butter and vanilla. And looking at the um, colors in this, I love this. This is awesome. Oh, look at all the colors. Well, this is good. Mmm. You definitely get like this butter and vanilla. Hmm, interesting. Oh, I look forward to warming this. This is really just a creamy vanilla blend to my nose. And you do get this melted kind of butter. I definitely do to my nose. That is very good. I look forward to that. It's kind of a basic kind of blend to me. I know a lot of you guys like marshmallow vanilla blends. This is a very, very good one. All right, my last thing I got was this loaf. And this is strawberry clouds. This is strawberry pound cake, waffle cone, sweet sugar cookie, and creamy vanilla butter. I wasn't going to get this, and she added this. I am a sucker for waffle cone blends. I found, like, I really like that when it's added to things. So I was like, all right, I don't need any more strawberry pound cake blends, but, oh, this one's good. Oh, this is really good. Oh, this, okay, this reminds me of a scent I have. Okay, this is really good. I don't know which, I have a lot of strawberry pound cake blends. Very good though, oh my gosh. I don't know it, which blend it is because I do have a lot of strawberry pound cake, but oh, I can't wait to warm this. This is just yummy. Oh, this is good. You definitely get the strawberry pound cake. I definitely get the waffle cone. And I do get this yummy bakery blend, which is obviously the sweet sugar cookie. Oh gosh, is that good? It's kind of got like this two shades of pink. Oh my goodness. And what was the undercolor? <gasps> the green. Gosh, this is really good. I'm so glad she offered this. I'm very, very happy. I'm really happy with this one as well. Okay, so that was my haul. I, I love Sugar Melts by Stacey. Like I said, I've ordered from her multiple times. She is super kind. She has reached out to me multiple times. I think I've shared that with you guys before. Um, her, uh, I don't want to overshare because I always feel like am I being like, is it any of my business to share things? Let's just say that we share something and we have something in common and she sent me that breast cancer warmer um and you all know my sister is struggling right now with breast cancer 
And uh, Stacy just has been a very kind person to me. She's reached out to me to check on me. I've reached out to check on her, up on her. I just have really enjoyed getting to know her. And again, that's really important when there's all these vendors out there and you're just like, okay, who do I pick? And, you know, I, 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 I like that she... If there's anything going on, she has always kept it professional, and I admire that, that if there's anything else out there in the world, she just keeps it professional. She's always open and honest about anything. She got this pre-order out early. I love that. She's really working hard on her pre-orders. She listens to customers. Um, you know, we've requested things that peach ice cream is like a love of mine. Uh, I hope that she has that in every pre-order. It's so good. Um, I just really enjoy her business model. I enjoy her as a person. So that's just, again, that's my opinion you're going to get. And I'm going to share with you my personal experiences. So um, does that mean that I love every cent from every vendor? No, I don't. But if every, like 95% of things perform, I think that's a good thing. And like I said, I've just really enjoyed getting to know her because I just have had my struggles and it's nice to know that I could reach out to someone else and, you know, just talk with them and have them be there for me. And just, I don't know, I just appreciate that in this world. There's a lot of kind people and I really appreciate that in um, the wax community because there can be some very negative and very um, unprofessionalism that I've discovered recently which is very sad for me again i i i have great things to say about stacy um let me know a favorite that you have from her um if you have tried her or not um or if you haven't what would you be interested in trying if you haven't found the peach scent that you love i would request peach ice cream i or her strawberry twinkies is amazing um so i just think she's great and honestly if you like strawberry pound cake on cold this is this i am gonna warm this and this is fun i am i want to cut this up right now and try this um so let me know your thoughts i today was an interesting day at work so it is monday i hope that your day was not as exciting um you know, we all have these different jobs and there's always like trials and things coming up. And I think that's pretty typical and normal, right? Um, I think it's how you handle things is what really makes the difference. I have my own personal struggles, but at work I can seem to keep it where it needs to be with my own anxiety. And I'm thankful for that. Um, I don't know what will happen next year, depending on how I feel about being a nurse, if things continue like they have the last two years. I, that's all I will say because I don't wanna be starting stuff. But for my own mental health, I don't wanna go into another school year or as be a nurse if things continue on the path that they're on. I just, for my mental health, I need some, it just can't continue. I just, I don't think I can do it. So. I'm going to keep ordering until I have to make a decision in June. And if I decide not to go back, then my buying will be like nothing because then I'll be at home, which is totally fine. And my husband will be taking care of me. And I'm pretty sure my limit will be maybe a couple hundred dollars on wax. So, which is totally fine. I'm not complaining. All right. I'm going to stop rambling. I hope you have a wonderful, beautiful, blessed day. Bye.